for 9288 or the act promulgating a comprehensive policy and a national system for ensuring newborn screening is a simple procedure to find out if your baby has a congenital metabolic disorder that may lead to mental retardation and even death if left untreated. Most babies with metabolic disorders look normal at birth. One will never know that the baby has the disorder until the onset of signs and symptoms, and more often, ill effects are already irreversible. Newborn screening is ideally done in the 48th hour or at least 24 hours from birth. Some disorders are not detected if the test is done earlier than 24 hours. The baby must be screened again after two weeks for more accurate results. Newborn screening is a simple procedure using the heel prick method. A few drops of blood are taken from the baby's heel and blooded on a special absorbent filter card. The blood is dried for four hours and sent to the newborn screening laboratory. Newborn screening results are available within seven working days to three weeks after the NBS lab receives and tests the samples sent by the institutions. Results are released by NBS lab to their institution and are released to your attending birth attendants. Parents may seek the results for the institution where samples are collected. A negative screen means that the result of the test is normal and the baby is not suffering from any of the disorders being screened. In case of a positive screen, the NBS nurse coordinator will immediately inform the coordinator on the institution where the sample was collected for a call of patients for confirmatory testing. Newborn screening is available in participating health institutions. If babies are delivered at home, babies may be brought to the nearest institution offering newborn screening. Screening of the newborn is an advocacy of the Department of Health in order to avoid metabolic disorders and even death. For Global News Network, Sheila Constantino reporting.